Hey, what's going on? Got gotcha. you middle of the week, Wednesday, July 12th. Update on your forecast. Meteorologist Joe Hansel here. Uh, the weather's saying good morning with a mostly sunny sky. A few clouds are drifting away, but it uh, should be a dry and mostly clear start to the day later this afternoon. Some clouds increase. We destabilize that atmosphere a little bit. And for some of us, not all of us, mostly in central and eastern Colorado, we'll have a shot of some isolated shower and thunderstorm potential today as we still warm up. Will be at least a little bit above average. If you're in that light green shade, you'll have a chance of an afternoon storm generally forming up right near the mountains and drifting slowly eastward. Includes areas near the San Juans, the Sangre de Cristo Range, the areas of the Front Range, the Southern Sawatch Range. Cities like Leadville, around Summit County, east of Aspen, Vale, Georgetown. I'll mention about a 10 to 20% chance of a storm today. Uh, the Plains areas, eastern Colorado, later tomorrow. Isolated severe storm threat for eastern Colorado. Large hail damaging winds can't be ruled out. Does not include Interstate 25 locations like Denver, though. Uh, weather alerts, we don't got them. It's a very quiet start to the day, and we should easily heat up above average. Near 100 degrees again in Fruta. 94 in Cortez, Vail at 81, 93 in Denver, 87 in Steamboat Springs. That's about 4 degrees above average, up to 8 degrees above average today over in Aspen. So we are warming up today. Winds are light this morning, and then we'll become moderate. Maybe some strong gusts between 15 and 25 miles per hour out of the west and west-northwest later this afternoon. So sunny and breezy days in store. In terms of rain amounts, for us, not much in terms of measurable rain is expected. Uh, we could have what's called those dry thunderstorms today. Uh, dry thunderstorms means it drops lightning, but not much beneficial rain, and might help to aid to some gusty wind potential especially in areas of central Colorado. For Denver, likely dry today, high near 93. Uh, we'll have a cold front drop in from the northeast, and that'll kind of set up shop all the way through Saturday. High pressure over the mountains will maintain those breezy afternoons for that weather pattern. Areas of eastern Colorado for the weekend, be weather aware, still some uncertainty, but there may be some heavy rain potential for the weekend on Saturday. For Steamboat Springs, 87, 82 in Rocky Mountain National Park, Eldora, 75. I will add the next two days about a 10% chance of an afternoon shower thunderstorm, likely dry for the weekend, maybe middle of next week a rainy weather pattern could return. Aspen near 84, Vail near 81, sunlight 83, 10% chance of an afternoon thunderstorm, most of it should miss us, but be weather aware. Watch that sky, see what the clouds do. There will be at least a slight chance of a storm today. Around Summit County we will have a slight chance this afternoon as well, highs range from the 60s to the upper 70s. Near 78 in Breckenridge, likely dry for the weekend. Down to the south, likely dry as well for spots like Cortez. Heating up near 94. We'll mention a slight chance of an afternoon storm for Crested Butte and Telluride.